taking away. Now, taking away is the same throughout the whole school. The way we do taking away is the same from year one up to year six. It's just that the numbers are different. So I'm going to show you how to do this. And you've got this in your packs, by the way. If you haven't got one, there are some at the front. So what we've been through so far is our addition section. So you've got year one addition just there. And we've gone through our number line. And we've also got year two addition on the following page. And just before that, for our taking away, subtraction it says at the top, you'll see that there is a number line method there. And that's the one that we're going to do now. And it's called complementary addition. If the children know how to add, they can take away. Okay, here we go. So, on your whiteboards please, parents, I would like you to write the following calculation. 12 take away, 8 equals. Can you write 12 take away, 8 equals. Now it's certainly simple for us because we know. We know this because we're very confident with our numbers. However, we've got to teach children how to do this themselves, and especially in their books. This is called pencil and paper. They have to do this in their books. So this is how we teach the children how to take away. We use a number line. We put the smallest number at the beginning. <laughs> so the eight goes at the beginning. We then have the 12 at the end. We get the children to jump from 8 to 12. And that shows them the difference between the two numbers. So the children go, right, 8, add 1, gives you 9. Add another 1, gives you 10. Add another 1 gives you 11 and then if we add one more that takes us to 12 and we ask the children to work out how many jumps they've done we've done one two three four the answer is four what they're doing is they're finding the difference between the smallest number and the biggest number and we're adding on so they don't have to do it backwards they just add upwards from the smallest to the biggest right we'll try another one so this is something that they would do in year one and in year two but i'm going to do it with i'm going to do it with a different number this time okay okay let's try one more we'll try a different number this time see if we can work this out parents i'll tell you what i'd like you to do this is always harder I'm going to put this on the board and I'd like you to have a go using the number line, see if you can get the answer of how your children would do it in their books. Using the first method that I've given you. Have a go yourselves, I'll come and have a look at your boards and see how you've got on, okay? So, let's try this. Let's go with 23 take away 16 equals. And remember, we've got a number line, we put the smallest number first, and then we do our jumps until we get to our answer. So why don't you have a go? We've got enough adults that can come round and have a look and see how you're getting on as well.